Howdy! This is the Gene Machine, coming at you live from the corner of my room. And hey, today we're going to be talking about some mobile game ads. You know, the usual. Today's ads are coming from the game Demon God, and if these aren't some of the most poorly made ads I've ever seen, then honestly, I don't know what is. On the screen now, you're going to be seeing gameplay of Demon God, and be sure to keep this gameplay in mind when the ads are playing, because these ads are chock full of fake gameplay. As always, this video was supported by our wonderful patrons. If you'd like to watch videos like these an entire day early and have your name spoken at the end of every video, consider checking out the patrons, starting at only $1. Anyway, there's some pretty wacky stuff in these ads, including multiple F-bombs, so let's go ahead and get dressed for the occasion and take a look at some of these ads, shall we? CP? Shut the f <laughs> I haven't spent any penny in this game. First, entering the game, you will be Dragon Timber, you go to kill one monster, and the Golden Dragon, then your CP will reach billion. Interesting, I will try it now. I... Okay. So, you can show nudity in ads, you can be racist in ads, you can be sexist in ads, you can have girls moaning as loud as they can in ads, and you can also now drop F-bombs in ads. Uh, wasn't there a major point in YouTube's history where advertisers were pulling out of the game because of videos that contain everything I just mentioned above? Okay, look. That aside, it's not like I think it's bad to drop swears in a video, right? I used to do it a lot and still occasionally do it. In fact, I'll do it right now. I didn't actually say anything there, I, I just put a censor bleep. Fun fact. But anyway, there's a quite obvious difference between a content creator swearing in a video and an advertisement swearing within the ad, whether all this is censored or not. The difference is that my channel, for example, is set to not made for kids, so kids aren't going to see me say right now. But we've seen time and time again that ads like these can and will show up on videos made for kids, and that's where the problem lies. Of course, besides the blatant F-bomb, let's remind ourselves what a mobile game advertisement should do. It should interest you into the idea of downloading the game, and that's done by showing you the gameplay. Not only did they not show you the gameplay in this ad, but they instead, one, showed a 3D animation and slapped a fake UI on top of it, two, tried to entertain an English audience with the most butchered English humanly possible, and three, titled the video with something I'd see out of those Spider-Man x Elsa videos. This ad is a complete waste of everyone's time and doesn't tell you what the game is about in the slightest. And so, it just makes me wonder. How did this possibly get past YouTube's review system when uploading the ad? Oh, and by the way, in case you were thinking, I mean, all they did was drop a single F-bomb, it's not like it's a big deal. Well, maybe this next ad will surprise you a little more. Just as a heads up though, they use copyrighted music in this ad, so I'm just gonna throw some Nintendo music in the parts of the ad where the audio doesn't matter. Okay, brace yourself. Let me show you my talent. Last time is long, long ago. What the f bro? So juicy. I, uh, you know, 
I've watched this ad like 20 times over for this video, and I just, I, I just still don't understand a single thing that went on in that ad. What I do understand, however, is that half of the ad was of the narrator swearing more than a Green Day concert. Listen, I've been saying this since day one. Mobile game ads are a mistake, and I would hope that this ad right here helps convey that. And, hey, if there's an employee at YouTube watching this, this ad is a prime example of what happens when you don't properly monitor the ads you allow on your site. It should have been turned down at the review process in the first place, but for it to get almost half a million views before the advertisers themselves probably stop paying for the ad to get promoted, that's when you know you've got a serious problem on your hands. Here's the next ad. What are you doing? New? Go away. F Bro, what do you want? Excuse me, sir. Oops, there is a little dust on your car. Let me wind it for you. Bro, your combo power... So low. Rich gamers spend so much at every turn. I'm too poor to recharge. Head out your hand. Listen, this is just more of the same stuff, and the only reason I'm showing it is to emphasize the fact that they are quite literally mass-producing ads like these, and at no point did anyone at YouTube go, you know what, maybe we shouldn't let these guys upload ads like this. And if they did, then they probably saw the amount of money that the company was willing to spend for the ads and said, uh, yeah, you know what, I I'll let it slide. They have ads like these, which, I mean, this is new to me, honestly. I've never seen a company create a fake login screen. That's just going above and beyond if you ask me. I wouldn't even be surprised if these are all stolen, especially this one. And by the way, I checked anyway, but it's not like I needed to check and see if this was fake or not. As with all of the other ads I've shown thus far, they're all in a landscape orientation. Uh, the game's in portrait mode. I digress. No need to worry. Doctor, what's going wrong? I'm sorry, we tried our best. We cannot save this game. It has a low drop rate and an inefficient upgrading system. Doctor, how about this one? Oh my god! Amazing! This game first your head with autoplaying. I reached level 306 hours and got many high level equipments. It also allows you to capture pets offline best than ever. Wh where the hell am I? Yeah, I'd say that sums it up pretty nicely. Now, believe it or not, I've only shown you a tiny portion of the ads coming from this company's page. As I mentioned before, the company is mass-producing ads, and might I mention, not even unlisting them like most companies like to do. You can view them all on this channel that I'll have linked in the description. I'm sure you could probably even find ads even worse than the ones I showed today. The fact of the matter though is that these ads should not belong on YouTube. None of these ads display the game, half of them have f-bombs in it, and quite frankly, ads like these are eventually just going to make bigger advertisers not want to associate themselves with YouTube. Remember me saying this when they inevitably do that anyway. I would highly advise not downloading this game or any game from this company for that matter. But anyway, hey, thanks for watching the video. If you're a member on Patreon, then you got to watch this video an entire day early. Which, on that note... In the $5 tier, we have Genti Dimitri, as well as Shiny Sock. You guys are the ultimate machine. In the $3 tier, we have That One Zoomer. You, my friend, are the advanced machine. And in the $1 tier, we have Name Expunged. You can call yourself an official machine. Thank you all for your continued support. And if you'd like your name spoken like this, consider joining the patron for only $1. Besides that, be sure to follow me on Twitter, you know, join the Discord if you'd like, and most importantly, be sure to subscribe. And with all that said, I'll see you all in the next video. Stay real.